Oh, hey Merlin! Hello! I feel like I just saw you. Hmm. Oh, that's probably why, huh? <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to yet another update of Disney Magic -E Kingdoms or Dylan Plays DMK, whatever you want to say. This is update number 167, so let's jump right on in. Alright, so the Striking Gold event was happening here, so we are definitely going to participate in that event and try to collect as many gold trophies as we can. Now, the Fang Palace bundle was available, so of course I did have to snatch that up as fast as I could. Also, the St. Patrick's Day bundle, I didn't end up purchasing it, but let me know if you did it in the comments. So here we go with the Fang Palace. I am so excited to see this. And um, it looks like we got some free gifts from the game because there were some issues. So, of course, I always love opening chests to see what are inside them or to see what is inside them. So we are got, uh, getting, oh, I cannot speak already, a lot of awesome tokens here. Happiness and also some blueprints. So definitely loving opening these chests. So we also got some of these chests. I think they're called, are they called resource chests? I always forget, I always forget, um, we're just gonna go with that for now, but a lot of different tokens there, and now we have some decoration chests, I love opening these and seeing if I'm getting anything that I don't have yet, it's always fun to get a new decoration, and also a concession chest here, so let's open it, a pretzel stand, love that, so we did get the Fang Palace bundle here, I hope I am pronouncing that right, I'll probably look it up after the video, and if I'm not, I'm gonna have to put the mispronunciation thing at the bottom of the screen. But with that being said, I did have to take out the beaver dam right here just so that we could fit the Fang Palace into its spot. I think I already passed it. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. And I was like, huh? Oh, there it is. Actually, no, I didn't. Okay, it was right there at the bottom. It looks so amazing. I love having it in the kingdom here, and I was able to enchant it to its first enchantment level already. So I decided to do that and we have a chance at dropping the Sisu's Ears Hat token whenever we collect from it. So now, let's see where we are at. And it looks like we are still trying to get Moana with some gems here. Let's see if we get her. And we didn't. Just a concession stand, but that's okay. We can always turn it into Merlin for some elixirs. And here we have Linguini going from a level 4 to a level 5, which is very exciting because that means we will probably be further in the Ratatouille, Ratatouille main uh, Kingdom Quest storyline. Linguini is now level 5. Yeah, let's do this thing. Alright, I agree. I am so excited to begin. Getting further in this storyline here but we do have to upgrade Remy now to a six and Disney Magic Kingdoms was five years old it turned five years old so we got the fifth anniversary DMK hat stand and wow I think I have the fourth anniversary and the fifth anniversary so this is my second hat stand very exciting to be getting that and I definitely decided to put it in the kingdom because it's such an awesome thing I believe my other uh, anniversary, the fourth anniversary hat stand is somewhere in the kingdom, but I just don't know where it is. But I love the fifth one, I love the sparkles on it. And here, Tuck Tuck is leveling up to, I believe, a level five, which is very awesome. I believe a lot of these characters have to be at least a level five to, um, get all the way through the um, event uh, storyline, but we're still not done in real time with the event storyline yet. Still trying to get Raya in real time. Tuck Tuck is now level five exclamation point. So let me know how you are doing in the event in the comments. I hope you all are doing amazing. We got rank number nine on the striking gold event or leaderboard, I should say. So we are gonna open some chests here. My game was glitching a bit though. So in a second, we will see what I got from this chest. So as you can see here, some tokens and some really awesome tokens that helped us, some a shrimp token, I believe, and a Sisu hat token, so that is amazing. And also, I did have a news uh, article, I guess you could say, about customer care, so if you wanted to pause and read that, you can always have that option there, just in case you missed it or you want to read it again. So, yes, uh, we are all set with another purchase, so if you're wondering what I purchased, can you guess? Let's see if you can guess. Uh... Let's see what it is. It is another Moana six pack of the legendary chests. Now, I was really down on my luck. Well, at least I felt like it. My boyfriend was like, you know what? 
just get another one just splurge and get another one so let's see if my boyfriend was right he's a very amazing man so I'm sure uh, we're gonna get super lucky here let's see let's cross our fingers for good luck hit that like button for good luck okay nothing yet we're on five out of six chests Whew, I'm a little nervous how about you all <gasps> new character music that well that means that we got we got Moana everybody which I am so excited about which means that we can go further into the side storyline for the event congratulations you completed the Moana collection and also 20 jumps for free awesome I never thought I'd get so attached to this one ore when I first went beyond the reef but then it got me through all those shipwrecks and the Kakamora and so I'm starting to think it's lucky. Plus, you know, it's got Maui's autograph on it, which he claims increases its trade value, so that's probably made up. <laughs> I will give him one thing, though. When I'm not out sailing, it does make a pretty good walking stick. <laughs> up a creek? Side quest. Send Moana to get some use out of her ore. Alright, well that sounds great to me. Moana, I wanted to run something by you. Remember how you said your people kind of remember me as the guy who cursed the world? Yep, stole Tafiti's heart, brought a thousand brought a thousand years of darkness, and you know, helped fix it, but mostly those first things. <laughs> Eesh. I'm guessing your people will remember you for just really piling on in the middle of conversations. Anyway, not the point. I was thinking, maybe if I tell you some better stories, you could spread them around instead. Image management side quest, send Maui and Moana to share flattering legends. Okay. Hey mom, I know all of us are trying to be better about sharing old stories, but I was thinking and... I don't actually know that many about dad, besides the big one. I mean, you know, stories from when he was younger. And you came to me instead of him so I could tell you the really good stuff? Ha! <laughs> well, alright. How about this one? This one time, side quest then Cena and Moana to share a story about Tui. Alright. I've always thought Moana was special, even before the ocean chose her. And as long as there is more she wants to learn from me, I will be with her wherever she goes. How sweet. The sky's the limit, side quest. Send Gramatala and Moana to look to the stars. All right, oink, oink, oink. Pua, who's a good piggy? Who's a good piggy? Oink. Is it you? Huh? Is it? <laughs> oink. Because I think it's you. I think that you're the good piggy. Yes, I do. Oink. He is so cute. All the way home, side quest. Send Pua and Moana to spend some quality time. That is so funny. I love the title of that quest there. And yes, everyone, we are also welcoming Sisu. So not only welcoming Moana this update, but also Sisu. Could you ask for any better? Mm, come on, Pengu, quit it. Five more minutes. <laughs> what? I, I mean, huh? I'm up. I'm awake. So awake, you guys, and totally pain. Quest complete. Welcome a water dragon. And there was some radiant chests available. Attention. Huh? <laughs> so Sisu was asleep. Pengu? Amba? Where'd you... Oh, oh, right. Still 500 years in the future. World still broken. Still a vaguely people-shaped. Got it. <laughs> God, people's heads hurt when they fall out of boats. Who knew? I mean, I guess Prani knew she was the shapeshifter, but... I hope I'm pronouncing these names right. If I'm not, I'm sorry. Wait, Raya and Boone are people? And Tuck Tuck too, kinda in a metaphorical, who's a good boy sense. I gotta find them. Where did everybody go? Event quest, send Sisu to find her friends. All right, so we are gonna send her on that quest there for two hours, and this is what it looks like right here. Ah, Drew! So that is that animation, I thought it was cool, so I wanted to zoom in, and here we have Moana and Maui uh, talking, so I thought that was cute too. Sisu, are you- you're okay, and you're wet. Guess you really can not swim like a water dragon, huh? <laughs> what? Who's a- dragon? <laughs> no dragons. <laughs> no dragons here. <laughs> uh, maybe I spoke too soon about you being okay, are you? 
fine, I'm fine. Just your normal everyday people friend, Sisu, who ran all the way here on the two to four people like she has. <laughs> I love that. Quest complete. Where did everybody go? Hey, but enough about me. Who's up for a nice, normal conversation about how short their body is? <laughs> oh man, that dialogue was a lot of fun. Wait, one Tuk Tuk, one, I mean, two people, including me. Where's Raya? I figured she'd be with you guys. Well, I, I thought she'd be with you. Uh, no. But look, we're gonna find her. We just gotta get someplace dreamproof and go over how we got here because I got a major headache and a short-term short -term memory that's a bunch of fun shapes and colors. I could really use a recap. Back on board, event quest. Send Sisu and Boon to discuss things on the boat. Alright, so we do have to get Sisu to level 2 before we can do that, but I do believe we already have the correct amount of tokens to get her to level 2 and yes we do so we are going to level her up here uh, instantly I was gonna say basically instantly but it was instant <laughs> hi Sisu oh thank you she's so sweet Sisu is now level 2 a gift oh you shouldn't have well, you're the one who's giving me a gift, so thank you so much, and thank you so much for the gem. 51 gems there, hashtag gem hungry as always. So we are going to send Sisu and Boon on that two-hour event quest right now. I think it was two hours, but Sisu has some dialogue. Remembering to be a person is hard, even temporarily for magic or hiding related reasons. Not like hard, uh, more like instinctively, because either way, I'm the same old ray of sunshine as always. I don't know why I said that like that. <laughs> like, to give you a for instance, walking on two feet, why? Maybe I just gotta practice doing it, you know? Sit down, stand up, walk on two feet, then repeat, 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 and low battery. <laughs> Sorry, you all. People walking, side quest. Send Sisu to walk like a person. All right. So, we also have another get off my beach, so we have to shoo away the crabs. I didn't tap you know, every, I think it's 10 every so many hours, just because I had a hard time finding them, so I just tapped the ones I saw and did my best. But here we are here, it looks like it was during the morning when I logged in. Okay, one thing you have to know, they're big into stone carving out there. So if you're looking for huge, magically charged statues of chiefs and ancestors past, boom, they're the ones to talk to. Also, if you're looking for expertly crafted, I don't know how to pronounce that, reproductions of a certain legendary fish hook, for example. Okay, I was actually asking whether you know how to sail there. <laughs> oh, yeah, maybe. <laughs> Quest complete. Edge of the map. Come on, I spent a thousand years stuck on a rock. Something has got a little fuzzy. That's fair. That is a good point. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what else is going on. I'm so excited. I love this dialogue. The last thing I remember, well, we hadn't got to to Lawn Port yet. So yeah, I was... It was when we hit those rapids. Remember, you were doing that thing I don't get where you hang off the side of the boat where we can't see you. Maybe it was Talon Port, sorry, and not Talon. I'm not quite sure. Weird, the last thing I remember was being under the boat helping you steer because I'm a super strong... Oh, no. <laughs> Quest complete. Back on board. Uh, okay. Good talk, but I'm going to find Raya now. Myself, alone, stay on the boat. Alright, so Sisu is going to go look for Raya here, which is very exciting. Raya is the last character that we need from the collection. Look, being a strong swimmer is my thing, so if I messed up my thing and the boat tipped over, which, you know, possible. I wonder if I was falling asleep here. <laughs> Then I've got a responsibility to make it right, which means finding Raya myself, which I still don't know how I'm going to do it. I'm sure you'll figure it out, Cece. You're amazing. Huh? Maybe this is a concentration thing. Instagram notification. Let's see. How can I make sure I stay super concentrated on Raya locating? Another Instagram notification there. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I think I'm getting a brainstorm here. 
Yes, Cece, you've got this. Concentration event quest, build the heart palace. That is amazing. So we do have enough event currency already, I believe. We just have to find a spot in the kingdom to put the heart palace. 10,000, yes, event currency, and we have 16,000. So we are good to go with that. I just had to clear a spot, and I did decide on the spot right here next to Boone's um, Shrimporium. So we are going to build the heart palace now. And it did take us eight hours to build that building there so that's very exciting can't wait until that is done so we can progress in the storyline I know this voyage is a big deal for you Moana but you've got this you learned wayfinding from the best right <laughs> you mean from you <laughs> Uh, yeah, that was clearly implied point is you've got the fundamentals down you're smart we'll figure the rest out Oh, and if you're worried about food supplies, I've got at least one solid recommendation for you. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Who's hungry, side quest? Send Maui to present a food source, i.e. hey hey. <laughs> Bok! <laughs> so we did have to have um, hey hey come off of that quest, and now he's gonna join Maui for a 12-hour quest, I believe, in the side storyline. Hiya! Oh, I was just practicing that little spin move at the end. I think I got it right that time. There are stories of our ancestors using canoe paddles as war clubs, like that. Some of them even had shark teeth at the end. Oh, wow. I'm so glad we're a peaceful people now, but I was thinking about bringing some of the old moves back as a martial art. It could be a fun thing to do at festivals, so long as we stick to the non sharp tooth kind of war anyway. Quest complete. Up a creek? They're way too dangerous, and I think Maui might get offended. He's had a shark head before. <laughs> Alright, so that is more amazing dialogue. A lot of amazing dialogue in this update, in my opinion. And now here is Boom going from a level 4 to level 5, which is very exciting and important. I did it, and gotta say, these shoes make it super comfy. You know, it might be kind of nice to wear dragon slippers sometimes. Not for swimming or anything, but just to be cozy. Oh, that's actually a really good idea. <laughs> Quest complete. People walking. Can I invent that if it hasn't been invented yet? I think it could be huge. Alright, well I hope that all works out for you there, Sisu. And now let's see what is happening. Boone is coming back into the kingdom here, which is very exciting. Hi, Boone! <laughs> He's so cool. Boone is now level 5. Who's hungry? I know I am for sure always and here we have Maui and Hey Hey on their little animation there so cute see they're on the horizon nine stars all bunched together I was just pointing them out to her some say they're little eyes and others say they're a mother and her children oh but either way seeing them is cause for celebration big happy families often are you know of course, when Tui was young, he wanted to have seven children. I think he'd have been too tired to do much celebrating. <laughs> Quest complete. The sky's the limit. Moana has more than enough spirit for him as it is. <laughs> See, more cute dialogue. Love that. And that is actually the end of this update. Update number 167. I hope you all liked it. And if you did, please hit that like button and leave me any comments that you want me to read because I love to read them. If you want to join the Disneya, Magia, King Doge family, oh, please hit that subscribe button and tap that notification bell so you know every time I post a new video. I will see you all on Monday for DMK update number 168. See you then. Bye.